so I'm putting on a new roof. And you say, why, why am I putting on a new roof? Because in 20 years, I'm handing this business to Lincoln and Kennedy, and guess what? They won't have to come on this roof for another 20 years after I hand it to them. These, this new roof should last anywhere between 35 and 50 years. So that's kind of where I'm at and what I'm doing. So that's why I fixed the leaks, but then another tenant had a leak. And you can see the wear and tear on it. So I would have to come and patch this up. But I said, fuck it. I'm just going to uh, get a new leak. I'm just gonna put a new roof on it. And it's expensive, but it's the way. And guess what? That's my middle school I went to. Imagine owning a building across the street from your middle school. Keep believing and betting on yourself. Niggas gonna try and convince you to rent property. Oh, rent property. Rent property. You could never own nothing. Well, nigga, you renting. Nigga, what, what, what you gonna give, what you gonna give your, your kids? An apartment you renting? Man, cut the bullshit out, man. You gonna give them a job referral? Or you gonna give them some some assets you're gonna give them some equity you're gonna give them cash on hand you know what i'm saying so i bought this building for eight and some change and now it's worth 1.5 million you know what i mean i built another unit on it during COVID, and now it's worth anywhere between one one three and one five depending on the market so there you have it man bet and believe in yourself and give your kids assets not keys to an apartment that you're renting do you understand what i'm saying assets you know what i mean cash what was it the cash flow i'm not gonna talk about the cash flow but po great positive cash flow and we working so i got my team over there we working we done laid the first third of it already done yeah you have it i'm the best landlord in the world <laughs> you know anyways man y'all have a great day bet and believe in yourself just think Oh, this was the school I used to tell you I used to walk from with my basketball and had to walk through 60s and A-Tray neighborhood, carry a basketball, because I don't believe in that nigga shit. I never want to be a gang member. Look how beautiful downtown LA is. Never want to be a gang banger, never want to be none of that. You know what I mean? You give, your, give your kids keys to a building that you own or keys to an apartment you're renting. It's your choice. Barbershop Conversations. Feel free to hit the subscribe button. I'll talk to y'all soon. Peace.